Pizza, as escorted by her father, Jay Otis. Kelly is involved in soccer and track at RHS and as a junior competing in a safe track meet last spring. As a young girl, Kelly loved make-believe adventures and as an almost grown-up girl, she loves to look for four-leaf clovers. Her favorite color is blue, her favorite movie is Can't Buy Me Love, and she plans to attend a four-year university. Kelly's friends would say she is very random, and anyone who knows her would say she is very kind and warm-hearted. Playing house and building forts were Taylor Quilty's favorite things to do as a child. Escorted by her father, Brian Quilty, Taylor would like you to know that her favorite food is spaghetti. Involved in track and field and National Honor Society, what Taylor won't tell you is she is one of the toughest senior powder puff players this year. The Disney movie Up is Taylor's favorite, and her favorite color is yellow. Singing in a car with the tunes turned way up is Taylor's favorite hobby. Taylor plans on attending college, pursuing a career in either physical therapy or architecture. Taylor's friends would describe her as sincere, and everyone who knows her would add that she is an incredible student. Lime green is Shawnee Garza's favorite color. Although, Shawnee knows much more orange and black. Eddie Garza, her father, is her escort tonight, and Shawnee is taking a few minutes away from her job as cheerleader to be on the field. Shawnee, just like Taylor, loves spaghetti, but she adds hash brown potatoes to hers, and that sounds yummy. As a weak child, Shawnee loved to play hide and seek and lava monster at recess on the playground. Pearl Harbor is her favorite movie, which makes sense because she wants to major in history at the University of Oregon. Shawnee's friends describe her as bubbly, but the rest of us who know her says that anyone that mixes spaghetti with hash browns is crazy. Hannah Russo is one of the busy girls, and her escort, Sam Russo, her dad, would agree. Hannah wants to attend Oregon State University and major in biology and then go to medical school. Hannah's number one hobby is soccer, and her favorite color is green. When Hannah was a little girl, she liked to play Twister, Polly Pockets, The Game of Life, and Dress Up. She has gotten older, though, and her tastes have changed. She loves clam chowder in a bread bowl, my big fat Greek wedding, and did I mention soccer? Hannah is involved in UT Metro Football Club, the Oregon Olympic Development Program, RHS soccer and track teams, as well as NHS. Hannah's friends would describe her as trustworthy, and we can also add caring and concern. The senior quarterback for the Power Cup team, Maria Capolis, is ex escorted by her dad. Yeah! Not only does she love to play powder puff football, but she is an avid snowboarder. Woo. When Talia was like maybe three, she loved to play Monopoly. <laughs> really, Monopoly? Talia's favorite movie is Finding Nemo. Her favorite color is blue, and she doesn't know what life would be like if she didn't have her brother Andrew to help her out. Yeah. Talia also plans to attend Oregon State University and one day attend medical school to become a pediatrician. Spontaneous is the word that Talia's friends would use to describe her, and everyone who knows her would say she is scrappy and fun. Tessa B. Horneman Van Volkenburg is escorted by her crazy dad, Randy. Brownies and pineapples are Tessa's favorite foods, but unlike another candidate we know, she doesn't eat them mixed together. Tessa plans on attending a four-year college and explore the field of engineering. While Tessa is multi-talented, she can also be a contradiction. Uh, as her two favorite movies are Mulan and The Gladiator, her favorite color is green, her number one hobby is painting. She has two amazing sisters with the same fine little names. She's involved in NHS, leadership, swim team, softball, powder puff. Tessa's friend says she's effervescent, and all who know her would say she's astonishing. Pink has a favorite color of Bonnie Uraka, who's escorted tonight by her daddy, Juan Uraka. Well, Bonnie has changed her mind about what she wants to study after high school. Right now, she thinks it will be communications and constitutional law. Bonnie's involved in many activities at RHS, including Link Crew Leadership, NHS, Key Club, Swimming and Track. The piano is her number one hobby, although if you heard her play, you'd say she was a pro. When she was small, she loved to play Monopoly. Bonnie's friend says she's happy, but Ari and Carson, her brothers, might have a few doubts. So there we have it, and very quickly, Erin, the homecoming queen for 2011 is Bonnie Uraguay.